My name is Tyler. I'm the product director here at Fazari Bicycles. I'm here to introduce our new Solitude 27.5 Plus and 2.9er carbon hardtail bike. Uh, we really wanted to take this bike from where we've been with the 2.9er cross country race bike and really make it more diverse. Now by widening the rear triangle, we are able to run 27 by 2.8 tires as well as your regular 29, 2.3, 2.2 race setup. As we were designing and testing this bike, uh, we really wanted to make sure it was the most durable hardtail out there. Um, and so what we did, we actually work with Iron Cowboy James Lawrence, and he took this bike, took one of our prototypes, and he took it to the top of Mount Kilimanjaro in Africa. Um, and by doing that, he beat that thing up. Um, he, he climbed all the way to the top, descended back down, um, and that was really just the tried and true test to make sure that the new Solitude 27.5 plus carbon hardtail uh, was that bike that was really gonna meet that expectation of someone that's super demanding, um, super hard on their products. Uh, we were able to keep the weight down on this bike. We're in the 900 gram weight range. Um, so it's really, you can really build that super, super, super light race bike, um, but also have that, that comfort of that carbon fiber layup that we've designed in the stays and the top tubes that we've really taken from some of our road bike technology and even in our mountain bike technology um, that has won a lot of awards um, in the ride quality. Designing this frame, we really wanted it to be that cross country racer as well as that you know XC trail bike um, that you can take in your backyard trails, um, take on uh, some packing adventures. And so we really integrated both into this frame. Really, really compact, short chain stays at 425 millimeters, really allows you to uh, make that bike maneuverable. It's fast in the switchbacks. Um, by doing that, we're also one by only. That really has allowed us to shorten up that rear triangle um, and make the bike really playful, really fun, um, and really fast. It also keeps that weight, uh, the rider weight over that wheel to help with that traction on the climbs. Uh, we're running a 70 degree head tube angle, um, you know, so it is aggressive enough that you, know, you really can go race that uh, really, really tight, really responsive. Uh, but as you do get in some of the rough technical terrain, um, there is a slack enough head tube angle there that you'd be able to uh, be able to descend comfortably through those rocky root sections. We do also incorporate an English thread bottom bracket. I know it's a small detail, but it's just one of those things for those home mechanics. It's just an easier bottom bracket system to work and service on yourself. Uh, the booster triangle 148 by 12 uh, and you know accompanying the boost on the front on the fork as well. With this bike, it's outfitted, uh, as you can see, at fazari.com with a couple of different options. Um, with the most popular option being the new SRAM GX Eagle 1x12 drivetrain that comes with the brand new 120 millimeter Pike fork. Um, the Pike's been redesigned, gone on a big diet, lost a lot of weight out of it, and we felt that this, this fork with this setup uh, really made a, a really, really stable setup for uh, those rougher cross-country race uh, courses that, that we're starting to see now with some of those drops and, and rock sections. We do have a price point build option uh, that's coming in at around the $2,000 price point with the SRAM NX1 drivetrain. Uh, both options come with a 120 millimeter travel fork, uh, either the 27 plus or the 29er tire, you can choose which option you'd like to go with. As with every Fazari bike, we complete the bike out with our 23 point custom setup. Um, and you can see more details at fazari.com.